is Townsend. Way to go through the middle this time. Go on! Oh, that is outstanding! What is going on, guys? And welcome back to another video, to another episode of my Premier League goal recreation series. If you're new around here, welcome. And please subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the content that's coming your way very soon. If you're not new, Welcome back. I'm pretty sure I say this every month, but today we have got some incredible goals. I mean, it's going to be so difficult to recreate some of this. September really was amazing goal after amazing goal. And I'm in the Arsenal shirt. Obviously, you guys know that I'm a lifelong Arsenal fan. I was very disappointed with the start of the season. We've gone from bottom of the table to like 10th in the space of a month. Which, yeah, doesn't sound that great, does it really? But we're doing so much better. We actually scored a goal in September and we obviously won that game against Tottenham, which was decent. There is so much more that I want to talk to you about. But for now, let's get into the first goal because I've got four to do today. And as I've said, they're going to be extremely difficult. Kicking off with one from the legendary Lingardinho. So it was West Ham versus United. United won the game 2-1 and honestly, this game had everything. Noble was brought on in the last minute to take a penalty, which he missed. And after we didn't know what Lingard was going to do, was he going to go to West Ham or was he going to stay at United? He obviously stayed and he scored against them. And what a goal it was. He receives the ball on the corner of the 18-yard box with a lovely little touch of his left foot. Kind of comes inside, shimmies around the defender, bangs it with his right foot into the top right-hand corner. This was amazing. Can't wait to try and recreate it. Let's get to the pitch. I wanna bend before I pray. So to ground, but I feel that. Oh, my word, off the bar for the first attempt. Oh! That's exactly more like what I would expect to do. Ah. It's actually very difficult to do this when there's no defenders. I'm like shimmying past no one. He's on form today, I tell you. Come on, Daniel. You can do better than that. I know I can. It's nice. Don't think it was high enough up in the goal. It needs to be a little bit higher, right? Of course Nick would say that, because he didn't get there, and he tried. He really tried. Here's Lingard. Jesse Lingard! Oh, oh yes! That is 100% the one. Received it on the left foot, shimmied around the defender, and then done exactly what Lingard did. Bent it into the top right hand corner. Perfect. Next up, we have an incredible volley. That's the only way to describe it. It was incredible. A left footed volley from Cater against Palace in Liverpool's 3 0 win. This volley was unbelievable. As I said, it was with this left foot, so this is going to be. Difficult for me to do. This was the icing on the cake. They're already tuning up. The ball's whipped in from a corner. The keeper punches it. And to be fair, it's not a bad punch. It's kind of cleared out to the edge of the 18-yard box. But Cater hits it so cleanly with his left foot. First time on the volley. Halfway up the goal on the right-hand side. Let's go try it. <clears throat> Let's go try it. Nick, how's your punching ability? It's all right. Yeah, it's pretty good, isn't it? But just for the sake of this, can you just throw it to me? Yeah. Is that all right? I brought him in on his day off. He's, he's doing well. Oh, my goodness. The sun is like just right there isn't it not only have i got to do this left footed the sun's in my eyes and i've got a bad left toe anyway that's the end of the excuses let's crack on i mean <laughs> as a first attempt if I, if that was going to be the other side i'd have got it i've just yeah right hand side good connection though Word. <laughs> that was one of the best left footed volleys I've ever scored. Standing by the edge, down, cause I want you to know. Just gone the wrong way. Did I mention that's with the sun in my eyes? Good save down to his right hand side. I just want to go the other way. You know what? That is, that's another goal, obviously. And it's the right side, which is which is very, very good. I've got one more. I think I'm gonna struggle to beat that on my left foot. But let me, hang on, can you even see what's going on here? What is going on? I'm gonna 
have to stop there because they are some of the best left footed volleys that I've ever had. It comes and punches. Kata! I mean, I'm moving on, that's great. Okay then, goal number three is all about that man again, Bruno Fernandes. You know what, we have to talk about Ronaldo. He's come back to the Prem and he's already proven how good he is in the impact that he's already had. I mean, a lot of people would argue they've only been tappings and yes, so far they have. The quality goals from Ronaldo are going to come and as soon as they do, I'm going to be there to recreate them. So Ronaldo scored a brace in his first game back but he was kind of overshadowed by Bruno Fernandes who scored an incredible goal from well outside the box right up into the top left hand corner. This was the icing on the cake for them in their 4-1 win against Newcastle. The ball comes across from Pogba, he controls it, one touch out of his feet and then bangs it. Let's go and try. Oh, that is so bad. Technique went out the window. As soon as the rain started to come down, my hair starts to get wet. I just can't focus. Oh, I dug that one out. The touch wasn't great. I didn't really push it and set myself right, but I took it anyway. Nick, oh. Oh, that is unbelievable, Nick. It wouldn't have been quite high enough. I was convinced that I'd gone in. And that is top draw. Every single time. Bruno Fernandes! Oh wow, that is, that is, a, that's a finish. Nick is beaten, there's nothing he could do about that. And last up, honestly, this goal, I think, yeah, this goal was goal of September for me. This is gonna be so difficult for me to try and recreate because it's another Andros Townsend worldie. And as you know, and as I know, he always scores great goals, but they're always of his left foot, which is his strong foot to be fair, but it's my weak foot. So he's not making it easy for this series for me, is he? This was Everton's 3-1 win against Burnley. I mean, just have a look at this goal. It's gonna probably appear somewhere on the screen right now. It's incredible. He picks the ball up. He kind of goes round one player and then he strikes it from so far out. I've got to be honest, I don't even know whether I should even bother trying this with my left foot. I mean, I did the volley with my left foot. That's one thing, but this, is gonna be ridiculous. So what I am gonna do is I'm gonna do this right-footed and then flip the camera so it looks like it's left-footed. That's gonna be the only way that I'm gonna get even close to recreating this goal. Do you mind? No. Oh, thank you. Guess it's time to get back out there. Oh! oh! That is so upsetting on every level. It's got to be close to, in between 25 and 30 yards. What? Oh, you are joking me! I may not get closer than that. Right to finish. Absolutely what I meant to do as well. almost caught that on your neck, what? My five attempts are way gone. I'm just having a another couple. <laughs> this ball is moving so much. <laughs> it's just such a long way out. And he made it look so easy. Here's Townsend. Way to go through the middle this time, go on! No! I thought that was it. I've come so close there, but I haven't managed to quite do it. So there we go then, guys. That is it. The end of another Premier League goal recreation episode. And I have to say, all in all, I'm pretty happy with that. To get three out of four isn't bad, is it? I know a lot of you in the comments are going to be saying there were so many other goals that I could have recreated. And yes, you're right, there were. But I've got to pick four. And also, I want to try and make them different as well. If there's similar goals, I try not to recreate the same one twice. So there was a very good variety in there, and I hope you'll agree too. Thank you so much for watching. If you're still watching now, you're a legend. You've watched right to the end of the video. You know what? I'm going to do a little bit of a giveaway for you because you've watched to the end and you deserve it. Ooh, what should you comment? DC loves Ronaldo. If you comment that, you're going to be in with a chance to win one of my t-shirts, some of my merchandise, which... I have got over here in a little basket actually. It doesn't look very neat right now. You can't probably see that and it's out of focus because I'm in focus, but yeah. There's some merch there that I'd love to give away to some of you guys. I'm gonna pick three of you who comment DC loves Ronaldo um, to win some of my merchandise. So there we go. Thank you so much for watching. You guys are legendary. See you next time. Don't